Hello and welcome to our how-to tutorials for V-Ray. In this tutorial, we show you how to create a pure water material with V-Ray material. We have this glass scene open here. So first, let's create a V-Ray material and assign it to the geometry. Let's start IPR. In the real world, purified water is transparent and almost completely reflective and refractive. Set the reflection close to white, because drinking water has mirror-like reflection but it's not completely reflective. We have to set the refraction to white. That means that the material is fully refractive, just as still purified water is. Ocean water, on the other hand, has lower refraction and is a lot less transparent. A general rule of thumb is that water and water-based materials have an index of refraction of 1.33. The index of refraction stands for how the material refracts the transmitted light. You can see that both the reflection parameter and the refraction parameter have IOR, but we have to change only the refraction one. There is no need to change the reflection IOR because it is locked to the refraction IOR by default and will internally use the same value. Set the max depth parameter of both the reflection and refraction sections to 10. The max depth specifies the number of times a ray can be bounced. Water, which is highly reflective and refractive, requires higher values such as 8 to 10 to look right. If the water is inside a clear glass, the glass itself requires the same max depth value as the one set for the water material. Leave the rest of the parameters at their defaults and wait for the image to clear out. You now have a material for rendering water. Thank you for watching how to make water with V-Ray.